My name is Michael Xu. I work intimately with the Chinese community. We made my father's pharmacy, uh, which is hard in the Chinese community. We made his pharmacy into a canvassing location. We converted all the customers into uh, voters by telling them about single-payer healthcare. So we made small businesses, locations to spread the word. So we, we used community, trust, to spread the word of uh, Bernie Sanders. And we also worked with the Chinese media. Because we're, we're part of the community, they aired the heart of the campaign all over the, the um, U.S. multiple times a couple days before the campaign. And, and we were also in the newspaper. So we, we, because of that community connection, uh, they allowed us to, 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 to uh, display Bernie in a very progressive way. And also, what I'm doing right now is that all Bernie groups act separate from each other. So I created an organization to have them work together as a cohesive unit and create a coordinated effort to have a system. Because when we have a system, these groups that work that are separate from them can come to life, can collaborate, and come, can become a coordinated grassroots effort. So we are here today at the first meeting of brand new Congress in Los Angeles. Tell me what your involvement is, what do you perceive it to be? It's amazing because we're going to go at the heart of the matter, which is our Congress. But we, we want to go to the, the heart of each community. It's not just um, as a nation, but it begins with our communities. And I believe that Brand New Congress is really going to target the people, the communities, get out onto the streets, not just you know uh, focus with other Bernie supporters or just be online. Get on the streets, get in the communities, and get focused right where where the where, where all the action happens. So that's that's what I see that Brand New Congress is going to be about. Do you think there is actually a possibility that any of the new Congress members will win an election? If we all work together, if we rise together, we, we have to, we have all these amazing uh, groups, we have these amazing uh, volunteers, but we all have to work together within the system, and BNC is part of that system. So we have to work together and, and get it get it out into the community. That's what that's how we're going to affect change. Are we all together? We're all we're all one. Not only are we together, we're all one, and that's what this whole movement is about. It's not about me. It's not a, it's. It's about all of us. My name is Melissa, and I am a volunteer. I'm a delegate. I am an activist. I'm an organizer, and I'm a voter. And that's my involvement with the campaign. All right. So today was the first meeting of brand new Congress. Explain what that is. Um, it seems like a, uh, maybe like a group that will be endorsing certain progressive candidates that come through uh, uh, for the next uh, election cycle. Um, progressive candidates that will uh, be 100% behind Bernie Sanders' platform. All right, so what are your hope and, and aspiration for this meeting? Um, that's a good question. I would like that, uh, that they actually um, achieve their goals of finding progressive, truly progressive candidates and getting them involved in the, in the new uh, Senate or the new brand new, the brand new Congress, basically, yeah. So my name's Emery Rogers. Up until a week ago, I was a United States senatorial candidate. Um, I'm here to support this, this coalition and to build a new coalition. Um, I'll be uh, already entering my hat into the 33rd district uh, for Congress in two years, and we're gonna run a ground game that's gonna be unparalleled, and hopefully as a coalition, I've already spoken to the other senatorial candidates, and they're going to take up their districts, and um, we're going to win this. Because if I got just the votes that I got for the Senate, which didn't even make me a contender, I would have won my district. So how do you think the future of this brand new Congress is looking to you? What, what is it that you can do, or what is it it can do for you? Well, with the experience that we've had from running, certainly we bring some uh, information about how to compile it. And I'll tell you, with me and Steve Stokes, and uh, what I got compiled, what he has compiled, what the other candidates that are, uh, that are in this room have compiled, we have a networking system that has all the information. It's just a matter of compiling the volunteers to make it happen. Uh, hi, I'm Michael Katz, and uh, I live in Los Angeles, and I've been a big supporter of the Bernie campaign since before he was running for president. I 
basically helped phone banking. I helped set up and worked on the July 29th meeting. You know, the the first, uh, the first I guess, fireside chat that he did online with over 100,000 people nationwide, 3,500 individual meetings. And from that moment on, it was just game on and try to really support a candidate that is fighting for everyone in America and not just special interests. So today was the first meeting of br brand new Congress meeting in Los Angeles. Tell me, what does it mean to you? The idea of brand new Congress appeals to me because we all understand the problems that we have with our federal legislature. I think there's like 93% disapproval rating of our Congress people, but yet there's also a 93% re-election rating. So 93% of our Congress people are getting, so 93% of our Congress people are being re-elected even though they are not being supported, they're not doing their jobs. And so I think it's important to create a national campaign that can pull people out of the woodwork that wouldn't normally run for office. So what does it mean? What, this, what does this meeting means to you? So the meeting means that people believe that this is something that's valuable and that's something that should be worked towards. You know, when you see this many people, over 100 people come out on a Tuesday or on a Monday night to continue working on this revolution that maybe is having some stops and starts, isn't, nothing ever goes the way people want it to go. And we saw a bright future and now we're uncertain. And so we want to take hold of that future. And this is an amazing way to do that because we all know that this change needs to happen to make America stronger. My name is Julie Tyler. I got involved with the Bernie Sanders campaign slightly before he announced. Uh, he was a keynote speaker with Marianne Williamson at the amazing political conference, Sister Giant, and I was involved with Marianne's campaign. I'm a big fan. Uh, so I immediately jumped in. I synced up with several different organizations and coalitions, one of which was Los Angeles for Bernie, another was Team Bernie LA. Um, this was after uh, and before I was phone banking from home. I traveled to Nevada to canvas. I went to my home state of Idaho. I attended a march and spoke and I canvassed and kind of had little mini barnstorms all around the state in very rural areas. And then I came back and they finally opened an office here, which was this amazing coffee shop very close to where I live. So I was able to come here on a regular basis and continue hosting events, but from this central place. And then I uh, became sort of, I sort of immersed as the phone bank captain, which of course is really important. We draw. We drew a lot of um, people here to call other volunteers to get on board with knocking on doors as we all had to train volunteers to call other parts of the country or other parts of the state and it was um, incredibly inspiring and just uh, a lot of hard work but awesome. All right, so tell us what happened today here. Yeah, so brand new Congress uh, emerged a while ago and it's all of these great leaders coming together and volunteers and recognizing that Bernie Sanders has has turned the light on. We have a lot of very awake people right now. They want to be more involved and they recognize that it's not Bernie, it's us and we have to go forward with focusing on the issues that are still at hand, all the work that we still have to do. And that is going to come at uh, the level of our elective officials. And of course at the local level, and we work our way up. So as Bernie's always saying. So the brand new Congress is really about mobilizing into teams who will do the work that's necessary, whether it's making calls to potential uh, members nationwide, uh, working on social media outreach, working on the data collection, working on uh, all of this, the video and the, the media that needs to take place and, and moving that forward in terms of getting our, um, getting people who have a progressive agenda, who are Bernie Kratz, uh, into uh, uh, positions of leadership, but who are elected actually. So I know it's an early question, it's the earliest stages of this campaign. What is your assessment? You think it might be successful? Oh, I, I think it's already successful. I mean, look at this group that turned out. People are so fired up. They're already mobilizing around certain calls to action and tasks. And uh, you're seeing that um, mentioned at the meeting and people wanting to jump on a particular uh, call to action, if you will. So 
so it's already successful, but it's, of course, this is just the, the seed that was planted, and so you'll see it take off.